Welcome to I'm Responding. Now is the perfect opportunity for you to subscribe to our YouTube channel of instructional and training videos. Scan the QR code on the left-hand side of the screen to be brought to our I Am Responding Insider playlist. We're looking at the system from the perspective of a new user, logging in to more advanced features along the way. From your computer web browser using Chrome or Firefox, go to the I Am Responding website as you'll see in the upper left-hand corner. When you get to the website, make sure to click on the cookies banner at the bottom of the page. In the upper right-hand corner, go to the login button. When you click the login button, you'll come to this page, login to I'm responding. The first field is your agency login. The second field is your member username. And the third is your password. Make sure to click the little box that says, remember me for this session, and then click login. If you are unsuccessful, click on the button that says can't sign in. Please remember that everything you type is case sensitive. Once you've logged in, you'll see your initials in the upper right hand corner. Click on your initials. It'll open up a menu. Choose edit my profile. This is the opportunity where you'll be able to create a username and a password that you'll remember. To familiarize yourself with the requirements of the username and password fields, click on the red question mark located to the right of the field. Your user profile drives the app. Fill in as much of the information as possible. The more information you provide, the better I Am Responding can work for you and your agency. After you have clicked the update button at the bottom of your profile, we're now ready to go to the app on your smartphone. From this point forward, our slides will be divided with Apple being on the left and Android being on the right. You're going to want to go to your source for applications, the App Store for Apple, Play Store for Android. In your appropriate App Store, do a search for I am responding. It's all one word. You will either get or install the app when you find it. On an Apple device, you will be asked this question. Be sure to click Allow. These images are from your device settings for the I'm Responding app. Please make sure to give as many permissions as possible, especially location services. By authorizing the location services, it will help the app map you to the correct incident location. Once you have set your permissions in your smartphone, you're now ready to log into your agency. Remember that all fields are case sensitive, and if you'd like to be able to see what you're typing in the password field, click on the option to the right of the field. When you're certain that you've entered your credentials correctly, select the red box that says log into agency. If you're still having difficulty, click on forgot your credentials or still need help logging in. These are now your agency settings. There are a number of settings that have been pre-populated and there are others that you can customize. For now, hit done in the upper right hand corner and we'll come back to this page later. On this page, verify that your agency name and your name is correct. If you are a member of multiple agencies, click add new in the upper right hand corner and log into that agency as well. If the agency is not using I am responding, remember that we offer benefits to individual members and agencies that refer others to subscribe to I am responding. Touch where it has your agency name and your name to get into the main part of the I am responding app. Now that we're in the main portion of the app, tap the three horizontal lines in the upper left hand corner and select mapping. In the information bar at the top of the app, you will see location services icons. If you do not see these icons, please make sure you check your permissions and your device setting for location services. Underneath your operating system, take a look at the image on the left. This is the now responding screen. Click on the respond now button. 
in the right hand corner. These are your response options that are completely customizable by your agency. Scroll to and click on the option you wish. Once you have selected an option, your name will appear on the now responding screen along with the option that you've chosen. To see your agency's incidents, tap the three lines in the upper left hand corner, scroll down in the menu and tap incidents. The screen that you are brought to is the incident list. Tap on the incident that you'd like to view. You will be brought to the CAD incident detail screen that shows all of the information about the call. You will notice at the bottom there is a respond now button. You can view the CAD incident detail before clicking your response. You will also notice that there's a blue icon that looks like a list. You can click on that to be brought back to the listing of members that are responding to. The button that we are going to be going to now looks like a map. This is the incident that you have selected now being mapped. You'll notice in the information bar at the top, the location services icon is present. On this map, you'll notice three hydrants. That is an example of more than 50 map markers that I am responding has available for your agency. In the upper right hand corner, there is a gear that will open up your map settings. The buttons on the right hand side of your map are your map tools. There are videos explaining your map settings and your map tools. Tap the back arrow in the upper left hand corner of your screen. This will bring you to the three horizontal lines, the menu option. Tap the three lines in the upper left hand corner and go to my settings. This is your opportunity to change any of the settings you would like for your individual agency. If you are a member of more than one agency, you can program these separately. When you are finished making changes, click done in the upper right hand corner to go back to the app. Thanks a lot for watching our video. To learn more about all of the features that you have just watched, scan the QR code on the left hand side of the screen for immediate access to our many training videos. Be sure to subscribe to our I Am Responding YouTube channel. If you have any questions, contact your administrator or our customer service team.